Hey guys, this is your RS3 and today I review the LEGO Star Wars Z95 Hit Hunter Polybag. So this is the uh, packaging here. So it's a polybag. So yeah, it's recommended for just 6 year and this is set uh, Cree 0240. And yeah, so just you just got the build here and you got the Yoda thing there. And the back, nothing else really. So uh, the instructions here uh, just shows you how to build it and it also does have advertisement for the uh, 2013 Star Wars sets. So yeah, you got two of the battle packs and you got the A-Wing. You also got uh, the Z big version of the Z95 Hit Hunter. So yeah, uh, pretty cool and yeah, that's it for the instruction. So the uh, extra pieces, uh, just some cheese slope and a uh, few, few plate pieces and also uh, just some studs. So this is the build itself here. So you can see it's not very tall, it's uh, re really low to the ground and this thing is very thin but yeah it still it uses uh, quite some pieces. But yeah so the front here you got uh, the the X-wing light nose here. So, yeah, but you got these side, the side thing. I don't know why it's popping out there. It's popping out a lot, and yeah, but I don't know what that really is. But you know, and yeah. So here, I guess you got the engines. Uh, these are the engines, like the X-wing, and yeah, uh, they are they are attached by this uh, minifigure attachment piece. And the cockpit, you just got a uh, uh, black, uh, transparent black cheese load piece, and yeah, you also got this uh, towel piece there. And yeah, you know, here you just got some towel pieces, and on the wings, you got these uh, blaster cannons, and yeah, you the bottom, you got the uh, slider plates, and you also got the landing gear, which uh, they use th this um, piece, this claw kind of piece which yeah it's uh, pretty interesting and if you want to remove the landing gear just remove uh, just remove three parts and yeah uh, you r remove the landing gear but yeah uh, the back here uh, you got the engines or the thrusters which yeah uh, you can you know move around because it's on a hinge so you can move up and down so yeah that's uh, pretty cool but aside from that uh, that's uh, pretty much it for the Z95 Headhunter so overall conclusion I think this polybag uh, the build here is uh, great like yeah Z95 Headhunter is a very special ship and yeah like the build here uh, I like how they use it uh, use the landing gears and yeah, uh, the the back it uh, it's great as well. So yeah, overall great great design and yeah, I recommend you buy it if you don't have the big version. But yeah, it's uh, pretty nice, uh, pretty accurate to the big one. So yeah, buy for this if I can find it down in the description box below, along with all my social media pages down in the description. So if you want to get physical alternative bricks, I'll put a link down in the description box below as well. But thanks for watching, I'll be seeing you very soon.